Let me tell you this, let me tell you right now Your exquisite kiss still burning Didn't know I missed this passion in life Now I'm addicted somehow Let me tell you why, what is up with your smile It's impossible, not melting, irresistible When I look through your eyes Hey guys, welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new here. Today I have some cleaning and laundry motivation for you guys. Um, we just got back from our little trip to Duluth and I had some unpacking to do, I had some cleaning to do, and of course laundry after the trip, all of the clothes that needed to be washed. So I hope you enjoyed today's video. If you do, make sure you give the video a big thumbs up, subscribe if you're not already, and let's just get started. So first things first, I just wanted to change the sheets on our bed. Um, the dogs were home the entire time we were away. Of course, we had someone watching them and taking care of them. Um, but I know they were sleeping in our bed probably the entire time. So I just wanted some nice clean sheets for us to be able to sleep in that weren't full of dog hair. But um, our trip was... So much fun it was so nice to get away with the whole family have um, my husband home with us for a good chunk of time to spend good family quality time um, I just love it I my cup was filled completely and we had such a great time probably our best trip ever with young kids so I'm really excited about that but um, if you didn't know, we did a little bit of an announcement during our trip on my Instagram as well as I posted here on the community tab of YouTube. So if you're subscribed, maybe you saw it or not, but we are expecting baby number three. Um, we're very excited about it. It feels so good to finally talk about it and it not being a secret anymore um, just because it's really been impacting our lives obviously it's a huge life event as well as a major health change I've been struggling a lot these last couple of months with um, just you know feeling tired lack of motivation as well as my migraines have been bad and I can't really do much about them um, and kind of feeling some of that morning sickness, all of that. And that's really kind of affected my, my YouTube, obviously, because I do homemaking videos. And honestly, it's been hard to keep up with homemaking things, <laughs> you know, like cleaning and laundry and all of that has been really hard. But we are in the second trimester, so I'm hoping that that spurt of energy comes and I start feeling better. I already have been feeling better, so I just hope it continues to get better so that I can get back on track of things. But I hope today's video gives you a little bit of motivation. I had so much laundry to do, and we are just gonna keep tackling that right now. Teardrops start to dry Even when the sun begins to shine Again Taking all the advice there is And none of it has helped Experience has made me realize That I won't build my life on empty words Being so damn naive It only hurts I'm so tired of So now I'm just kind of putting all of that laundry away. I have a few things to hang, so I'm going to get to that as well. And then we're going to do some unpacking and just kind of tidying up 
in the living room. I didn't put too much on my to-do list this evening because I am still recovering from our trip. It's hardly a vacation when you have young kids. I mean, let's be honest, as much as it was fun and wonderful, it was still exhausting. <laughs> and um, I'm still recovering a couple days later. So I've just kind of been um, splitting up the things that I need to do over the week so that it is not too bad. But I'm pretty proud of myself for how quickly I unpacked the suitcases. Usually I'm the type of person, like there'll be things in the suitcase a week or two later. I know it's really annoying of me and I get annoyed at myself, but it's just kind of how it goes sometimes. But this time I didn't want that. With the kids home, I just wanted the clutter gone, so we took care of that today. Are you the type of person that unpacks right away, or do you wait a little while? Let me know down in the comments So as I had said, I wanted to do a little bit of tidying up here in the living room. There wasn't too much to clean up after I took care of the suitcases, but the major thing that I need to do in here was vacuum. My goodness, the hair that I picked up, the dog hair that I picked up from the few days that we were gone was disgusting. I think I threw away or I had to empty the vacuum like three times, just vacuuming the living room. So the last time I vacuumed was the Thursday before we left. And then, like I said, we got back on Monday. So I vacuumed Tuesday. Oh my gosh, disgusting. The dogs, I'm sure, just stress when we're not there. So I feel kind of bad about that, but it is all taken care of now. But I just want to give you a little bit of a real life moment in case this is ever your situation. And trust me, it is not only just when we go on a trip. Sometimes you just forget to get that vacuum out or maybe you are tired or unmotivated and you can't get to it as often as you would like. And so sometimes it piles up, especially when you have dogs and that is okay, people. We're just trying to live our lives. So today, if you have a spot in your home that you have maybe been neglecting a little bit with the vacuum, why don't you vacuum along with me right now?
that is about it for today's video guys I really hope you enjoyed it I hope it gave you some motivation to get some cleaning done or laundry done whatever it is you need to tackle if it did make sure you give this video a big thumbs up subscribe if you're not already and I'll see you guys in the next video bye Radio.